does the Old Testament endorse slavery? We sometimes hear from religious apologists that this isn't the bad kind of slavery that comes to mind when we think of the antebellum slavery of 19th century America, for example. But Josh Bowen wants to argue that this is a mistaken idea. Apologists will say, well, let's just start off by making it clear that slavery in the Bible is nothing like slavery in the American South leading up to the Civil War. And the problem is that's just not true. When you compare the laws in the Hebrew Bible to the laws that were on the books leading up to the Civil War, they're not only very similar, but they have the same legal rationale. And so ultimately, I think a defense of Old Testament slavery in that regard can very easily be a defense of antebellum slavery and ultimately just having slavery again. So that's why I think it's a really important topic.